What's up guys, Zach from Zach's Hockey Box here with Kitty, Kitty Commentary. Oh. And we are at the Calder Cup Finals. I am crouching, by the way. That's what you're getting here. Because we, we're trying to find a good spot to film with it not being too loud and not getting too much background noise. But yeah, we, uh, we're at the Calder Cup Finals Game 2 here at Allstate Arena in Chicago. And we're going to open up some packs real quick. Kitty Commentary will go first. We're still looking for the Spencer Knights. Uh, stand up now. Uh, yeah, I got a shirt. I got a shirt to wear. Uh, it's too small. It's a large, more like a medium, but yeah. So, uh, so I got the hat though. Hat and we got a uh, puck and all that stuff. I'm gonna be showing you guys at the end of the video. We'll go through and show everything. Oh, nice, the young gun. Yeah, too busy talking over me, so it's fun. That's right. Nobody wants to hear you talk. <laughs> yeah, so that's why I'm wearing this, this shirt again. Uh, that you guys saw in the last video that I had. But, uh, I wasn't planning on wearing here. Definitely planned on, and yeah, I'm just kind of strolling through the ball real quick. We got a canvas, Patrick Line, right there. So, so far, Kitty Counts here, I think, is winning that one. Only because I got a young gun? Yeah. Oh, and another us. one. Oh, nice. And I don't think I have Philip Gustafson yet. So, that's probably our two young guns on this blaster. This is just a blaster of series one. Um, we will be opening up Series 2 probably shortly. Um, I don't know if it'll be this week or next week. We'll see. But uh, I am planning on opening it up, especially once the retail stuff starts coming out. Definitely be opening up a lot more of it. And I've got a bulk pack. So I'm not even going to show that one. <laughs> How do you know? I think the commentary is one. How do you one. know? That's because I've been howling. Hey, she's got the dazzler. Jeez. Coming in Oh, great right point. Which, as of this recording, Colorado is losing 2-1 to one, um, after the first, so. Let's see, Let's see if you get anything and in the your Wolves. last one. Wolves are winning by quite a few. Like, what was it, four at the end yeah, of the first? So, I got a Joel Farabee mm. electromagnetic, that's all I got. I didn't get an electromagnetic. Well, I did get the Dazzler and the so you guys would be Oh, yeah, that was your last pack. So anyways, yeah, so there you go, guys. Uh, we'll probably do a recap video uh, part after this part. So, yeah, thanks for uh, joining us for this quick little break, and we'll show you guys talk to you guys about the game in just a few seconds. Oh. Hey, guys. So, uh, as you guys saw and um, can tell, uh, it's a couple days later since we went to the Chicago Wolves game against the Thunderbirds. Uh, you guys saw us open a couple packs there. So, overall, it was an awesome game. Uh, great experience. First time ever going to a finals game. Uh, we were able to pick up this hat, which uh, 47 brand. I do like 47 brand hats, so I'm happy about that. We got a shirt that says they're Western Conference champions. We got a puck for the finals, which will be in the backdrop of this uh, new set. Um, we all in all, it was a great game. Wolves won 6-2. to two. It was a little bit of a slower game because uh, they scored. It was like 4 nothing at the first period. So I'm like, oh, man, this is going to be a long game if it stays 4 nothing. Uh, but the Thunderbirds came back, scored a couple in the second, and then... Uh, yeah, the Wolves scored again, I think, to the, again, the next two goals in the third. So, yeah, all in all, not too bad of a game. Um, overall, again, uh, if you guys haven't watched my video about the Allstate Arena, it's a, it's a, it needs to be a little upgraded for sure, but uh, it definitely is one of those arenas that makes you uh, uh, feel compacted and nice and tight to that, that ice, so it's nice. Uh, they didn't even sell it looked like any tickets to the upper bowl, so everything was lower bowl. The whole lower bowl was packed. It was, it was a really awesome experience going to that game. I'm hoping that they come back for game six because I'd like to go back and actually maybe see them win the Calder Cup. It'd be kind of cool. But don't know. We'll see how that all goes. But yeah, that was uh, just an awesome experience. We are going to open up some packs, our first packs, a Series 2 hockey right now. Uh, I do want to throw an update in this as well that we will be opening up some Series 2. We, I just ordered a couple boxes. So they are on their way soon. So hopefully that'll be that'll be next week's video. So we've got Dustin Brown. we got ourselves Andrew Majipani. Got ourselves a Travis Sandheim upper deck portrait of Niles Lundquist, rookie for the New Jersey New York Rangers. Sorry, got a checklist there. We got can't tell Tyler Mott. There we go. <laughs> we got ourselves Matt Dumba and Brian Russ. So not too much in that first pack. But yeah, uh, all in all, great experience in the Wolves game and like I said, series two boxes on the way. And uh, as of this recording, last night Colorado one win away from. Uh, from winning the Stanley Cup, so that's that's going to be interesting. Uh, we'll see if they can put a stop to Tampa Bay's. Oh, nice! Some Seattle Kraken cards finally. Mark Giordano, of course, the, the one player that's not on the team anymore, right? Brendan Carlo, 
We got ourselves Ilya Labushkin, another Seattle Kraken, Chris Trieger. So glad to see Seattle Kraken cards finally. Rocco Gamaldi. We got ourselves uh, Hen Henry Yukiharu and uh, UC Saros portrait. But yeah, uh, I'm definitely just excited to see if Colorado can end that streak for Tampa Bay. Like I said, I'm, I'm, I'm pulling for Colorado. It'll be nice to get some, something different for, <laughs> for a change. Oh, we got a young gun. Okay, we got one young gun, so cool. We got ourselves a Robin Leonard. We got ourselves here Kirby Doc. Is that a Brady Shea? We got ourselves Ryan Hartman. We got Alexander Barkov. We got ourselves Austin Matthews. And our young gun is, can't read from here, Brendan Duhame for the Minnesota Wild. And we got a, ooh, a cool Victor Olofsson pink Dazzler. So super excited about that. Love the Dazzler. So happy that we got a Dazzler. Obviously, I'm really looking forward, if you guys don't know, if you can't figure that out. Uh, more excited Lucas Raymond cards. Uh, at the National, or not the National, at the um, sports card show we did this past weekend, uh, one guy did come up and he had pulled the one of one out of 100 of the Lucas Raymond uh, Upper Deck exclusive cards. So that one is off the table, guys. If you guys have been looking for those, one of numbered one out of 100 is off the table. And our last card is going to be a Tyler Radish on a roll card so yeah that's that's all we got for series two right now not much like i said i have a couple boxes uh coming in the mail i just ordered them uh, the other day so they got shipped out i got the confirmation today that they got shipped so in a couple days hopefully like i said next week's video will be uh series two openings for a couple weeks because i got two boxes so yeah all in all guys thanks for watching again uh if i cannot recommend up going to a chicago wolves game next season uh for sure if you're in the chicago area or anywhere near there definitely worth going to but uh thanks for watching guys it's been zach from zach's hockey box and i will open for you guys again very very soon